hey guys welcome back to our youtube channel today's gist is on shayi edun recalling that people have been waiting for shayi edun to be dragged on social media after the popular blogger called jislova posted a picture everyone has been waiting some people have gone ahead to the dm of this blogger spilled the bean about shayi edun and be wondering why people are after shayi edun few weeks before the posting of picture by the popular blogger she had shared on her social media page that she just got herself a house a home in the uk a mortgage house to be specific and it's basically for business and she will be renting it out well people have several opinions about this new achievement of shayi edu as some people are saying it's not possible for her to have gotten a home in uk since she is not living in uk it's hard for uk government to give you a mortgage house but she is doing the system that she bought this house through her uncle and some people have the opinion that mortgage house in their opinion is a waste of time in no time she's going to go bankrupt and it's a bad choice few days after she posted about her new house some fans had gone ahead to allege that she received a certain amount of money from them and they were expecting a giveaway of that amount of money in multiple folds and some people one way or the other had concluded that she is robbing the members of the public and it's possible part of that money is what she used to pay our mortgage bills in the uk and this is one of the reasons why a lot of people had gone ahead sent the picture and the post of shayi edun to popular blogger just over that this popular blogger should go ahead and make investigation if truly she is the owner of the house or she's trying to mislead young nigerians and our fans after several weeks of dms messages to this blogger this lover eventually reached out to shayi edun and shayi edun responded politely to each of the question asked but in the question asked there was a striking matter which got a lot of people talking which is the part where the popular blogger mentioned that Adeni Johnson, that is the husband of Shei Yedun, hit her in London some years back and that Adeni Johnson was banned by the UK government. Hence, he was not able to get his papers so he could go with Shei Yedun, celebrate this new achievement. However, Shei Yedun appreciated her husband as she acquired the new mortgage home and thanked him for his support. So here was the chat that transpired between Shei Edu and the popular blogger called Just Lover. And I quote, Dear Shei Edu, Info got to me say you didn't buy any house. You just want to mislead your fans and it's a form of advert to the company. How true. Uh -huh. That's what I am saying. It's a business strategy. Nobody say you buy them. Um, you don't stay there. As a matter of fact, I heard you and Johnson had issues at the UK because he hit you and you both were deported. And that's why Johnson can't go back. Having such case with UK government and still getting a mortgage house doesn't add up because the source I got that info from is very legit. This was the popular blogger. She had responded by saying, Oba, I was about messaging you. Ha. I'm not misleading anyone. It's a mortgage house. I can't lie to you. It's a beast thing. Not as if I want to live there. As I am chatting you, I'm back home. Just posting my UK pics. I'm saying paying mortgage is a beast cause of getting tenants. Besides, it's a small apartment. That's the beast part of it. Not a business strategy, Oba. Of course, yes. Ha. That's a lie. Deport K. I wasn't deported though. We didn't go together because he's in for renewal and its passport stayed longer because there's no fast track process again. My own visa took 10 weeks. My uncle was the one that introduced me to the mortgage stuff. We bear the same surname. You can check the tag on the post. I wasn't deported. I can't lie to you. If someone is deported, I will lie now go back. My uncle is a realtor there. He sells property. He's been there for many decades. This was Shea Do conversing with the popular blogger called Chase Lover. Even more details and more insight to what is going on, the popular blogger had a caption saying, and I quote, Hello, Twe Twe, GLB Nation, happy Sunday. So recently, Shai, also known as Shea Do, bought a house in the UK 
I don't even see her side because now around that time, small paps they chop her own kin. Fiam, before you know it, people begin send them to me. Say, JLB be digging to this. No be she get out now. Advert. She did mislead. They mislead her fans. Shoe mislead Bao. Na lie me I hate to. Why would she be misleading her fans? That's why I carry my two left legs. Enter her DM. Yawa she and lembe yo she well done no. That's why I greet her. Come ask her question. Say how far? Them say you do add fake life join. That's what she say. She bought the house. Say now nah, uncle where they into real estate help him. I further ask her how this is possible because the last time I checked, she and Adeni been fight. Where that one beat her for Bodo Yibo over cheating allegations. Now why would me to realize they sue I'm deaf I'm say now she they settle their fight because that one was a witness then. Now why them deport me the then? So I know comes be if now for UK or now that as the yam pepper scatter scatter happen. So I asked how it is possible since them get issue with UK government and UK government now one of the most strict government for the world so she said she doesn't have any issues with uk government who but in talk for uncle johnson now so i further as say if it's true them no get issue why need you no follow him she talks any pass but no quick come out as much as i did try find out the truth she they bend me but investigations are ongoing i have forwarded the house to my source in the uk make we know what's up if she's the owner congratulations if not i wouldn't like that she's misleading people out there and the matter too messy gone grb nation no green mirror since ever since i don't post she picture when i still the enter dm come meet me well i am coming on make we no go post wrong gist make una give me time make i for do my thorough investigation on the house she was pleasant in answering all the questions but that still won't stop the truth. When I know say I know they talk with say I don't know. So let's do our investigation properly. I come in peace and quote. This was a popular blogger sharing this with the members of the public. But the striking thing of all those messages is the part where blogger mentioned that she Johnson beat her and that was why they were deported. And she didn't object to that particular phrase of Niyi beating her. It was due to infidelity on her part. Well, speaking of the mortgage house, and she insisted that she bought it through her uncle. And some people claiming that she can't get the house if she's not living in UK for a period of time. From what she stated, that her uncle has been living in UK for decades, it's possible she bought the house under the name of her uncle. This is so because part of the people who she showed gratitude to was her uncle. Well, we say big congratulations to Sheye Edun once again. Guys, there you have it. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment in the comment section below. Thank you. Bye.